Hey guys, D Mike here, and welcome back to another episode of Super Mario Odyssey. Last time, we finished up the Cascade Kingdom, got our Diner Sour on, and today we are in the Sand Kingdom. Now, I do have bad news. It's not my first recording today of this game. Um, I actually did a pretty solid recording where I got 15-ish moons. Am I going to make this? An auspicious start, um, where I got like 15 or so moons. I'll go into this real quick. Um, and it didn't save for whatever reason. I have the audio, but the video completely bamboozled. So there's nothing to show from that, unfortunately. it's I did get 15 of the moons. You can see them on the counter up above. So you can know that I'm telling the truth. But unfortunately, that will have to live in the pantheon of secrecy since I can't actually go back and prove it. And the funniest thing though too, was as I watched the recording program, it said, you know, it said it was saving and then it froze. And then in my ultimate intelligence, I decided to hit the save button. So I can't even go back and replay it from a manual save. So clearly we're doing great. Um, apologies for that, I guess. It's not a big deal, I mean, it's just 15 of those moons you won't see, but you can see that I did do them, so we are on track. I'm still very much committed to hitting the mark that we did. So first moon of the day is going to be here with our boy Glideon. Well, first legitimate Toast Train moon. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this should not be that tricky, but for some reason it uh, it's very perplexing to me that I can't do this, so... But the majority of the moons that I did were in the village itself. I got one for this cool new drip that I'm wearing. And then also I had some of them in the in the ruins as well. So that's where I got the majority of this haul. Thank you. Goodness. On the lone pillar. So that's pretty much it, I think, for this area. I want to go back. I'm going to take the warp one more time if I can. Because I want to get to the top of the inverted pyramid. I don't think there's anything that you get for doing the inside of the pyramid again that I'm aware of. But we do have this fast travel here. I hope that this is... Well, there's something up here. It's Peach and Tiara. Very nice. These always result in moons, of course. That's right. The world may never know. Thanks, Peach. Beach clearly rocking the two-wheeled suitcase because she is an inferior traveler. Four wheels is the pro move. Okay, so... I don't know... What is this? Is this the rabbit? What is happening? Okay. I don't think I got anything for- I, I ground pounded it last time, I didn't do any- What is happening? What is this? I will say though, I'm gonna be incredibly angry if this one doesn't go through as well because that will mean that I've gotten roughly 30 power moons without anything to show for it and that is just unacceptable. I don't really have a way to do a backup of this that I'm aware of, so hopefully that doesn't happen. Oh, we already got this one? I feel pretty good. I feel like I've gotten most of the moons checking our list here. Um, I've done a pretty good job of getting most of the moons that are here. So... I don't feel bad about it. I'm trying to make as much progress as I can. There was the 2D section. Just below. Can you do a fast travel from up here too? Take a Jaxi ride? Oh, you can. I don't want to do that, but I can. If I was so inclined, which I'm not. I'm feeling a little inverted today. Um, yeah, I don't remember how to get back to this. Whee! I don't want to go in there, no. Rip Mario's ankles. Yeah, I feel like that's 
that's pretty good with the amount of moons that I'd be able to get. Oh, there's that bird I kept talking about in the last episode, but it doesn't matter because you'll never believe me. I gotta catch this bird. Kind of like the... I mean, there was the bird in the, um... In the, in the Cap Kingdom. Similar, similar kind of vibe. I don't know... Oh, this is close. Okay, that's... That's goober side, unfortunately. Where was that? Can I glide? Ooh, maybe I can glide onto it. Does he have enough altitude to make it? Do I have the landing skills? This is like me trying to play pilot wings. Poorly. And boop. There we go. Okay, not bad. I landed the poison swamp. And I don't think I can get out of this. Nope. That's okay. That's a tactical reset. But I do want to grab that bird. Okay. I'm feeling pretty good about this. But I don't know... Uh... Oh, have I not done this? I guess I've never really had an incentive to it. The Jaxi ruins? Okay. I mean, I'll take it. The treasure of the Jaxi ruins. Yeah, I feel like I'm almost... Like, I'm I'm doing really well with the, um... Get, come to Papa. I'm gonna cut you off with the pass. I am not. Okay, just kidding. What do you have to say to me while I wait for this guy to bring it around town? Okay. Is that important? You can see that the bird was flying around the perimeter here. I mean, not with that attitude. Jeez, lady. All right. So I don't think this bird is going to steal our cap like the dumb vulture in uh, Mario 64. That would have been really hilarious if I hit that over the swamp and I couldn't get it. All right. So I feel pretty good about that. I mean, like, for all things considered... Having a basically a lost episode, which actually really angers me. Um, can you tell? But having a lost episode, you know. <laughs> you have to be very good at long jumping, apparently, for this one. Okay. Uh, where was that? This is why we gathered all these coins for all these tactical resets we're going to be doing. But I mean, I've already kind of made amends, I would say, with the amount of awesome moon capturage I've been doing so far. It's really hard to judge the depth of this. Whew! That is close. Sand Kingdom Timer 3. Oh, is there another bird over here? There is. I don't know if this is bird is related to that bird. The bird is the word. Maybe there's two birds. And we're gonna kill them with one stone. But you never saw that coming. Alright, where are you? There's a moon over here as well. Ooh. This area looks new. I don't remember any of this at all. Maybe the bird will circle around. Yeah, this is this is brand new to me. Looks like there might be some fishing to do, huh? This guy, he's so hot, he can barely move. Story of my life. <laughs> right, viewers? So, okay. So, it looks like the bird circles up and around this area. It comes to like this. You don't have to go that far away, do you? Unless that bird is entirely unrelated, maybe. When I know that, but that's not like the move that I'm trying to do where it's like you almost do like a homing attack back onto the cap itself. I don't know how to do that. Yeah, this area is so huge. I mean, like, let's check what the map says um, in terms of moons. Yeah, 38 out of 89. That's, that's immense. Can I climb this tree? Oh, I can. All the way to the tip. 
Scoop. Nope. Needs that kind of a jump. The mighty leap from the palm tree. And as per usual, I have no idea if it's... Um, are there invisible fish here? Yeah, there are. I have no idea if... Um, the moons I'm getting are pre-existing or not. Great. Is it, there's got to be a big boy in here, right? Is that the use of the moon one is the big boy? This looks like a big boy. I just hope that this recording saves, because if it doesn't, I'm going to be very mad. I'm shaking my bro controller for you, viewers. Is that a moon? Yes, it is. I mean, I've almost hit 30, which is good. Because this area has so many um, moons, this is actually kind of, maybe maybe there's a silver lining, viewers. Maybe there's a small shred of a positive element that we can do here is the fact that because I have so many moons to get in the Sand Kingdom, that I won't be overdoing it now. Because one episode, you won't be seeing three Sand Kingdoms in a row. Oh boy, I don't like this. Oh, I hate this. Is it just the six? The six pack? Okay, we'll take that. These are pretty easy, so this is another one of these reasons why I feel like Odyssey... Odyssey's a pretty good example of, like, modern gameplay society. The source of seafood. Um, I feel like that would be the Lake Kingdom, not here, but... Um, that's what's interesting about this kind of stuff is like the instant gratification you get from this. Like the struggle that you have to do to get these types of moons is not really that high. Um, I mean, there's still effort involved, of course, like you still need to be trying. But overall, I would say the ask is a lot smaller. And you know, I'm more of a fan of a nice big ask, so. All right, this looks... Oh, how do I get that? Is there a platform down there? Get over here! Okay. How do I... Oh! Oh! Well, don't mind if I do. Whoa, okay! Is there a way to... How? How do they... Oh, this moves? What? I did not expect that to be a thing. Okay, tactical reset. Oh. It's an elevator too? Alright. I'll take that. Jump onto the transparent lift. Yeah, we've almost hit the 30 mark, which is actually really good. Um, given the nature of how poorly I was playing before. Um... Eh, I shouldn't say poorly, exactly. It wasn't my fault that I lost my recording. It wasn't, it wasn't. Oh, boy. Whoop. I like this. Nope, I don't like that. See ya, bye! I don't know if these are moon block moons or what, but I feel like this is going to put me ahead of the curve a little bit. If I can gather at least three moons in the next 20-ish minutes. Okay. Shouldn't have said that. Probably jinxed myself. But yeah, this will... I don't know... This is episode 29? 28? It'll obviously supplement um, what I've already been doing. So you'll have to forgive me that this will fulfill that episode. Nothing will change aside from the fact that you didn't get to see. I should probably just stop talking about it. Let bygones be bygones. Let glidons be glidons. You know what I'm saying? Any moon over there? No. Whoa. Whoa. Spooky. Yeah, you got to get your little tootsies moving on these ones. Use the the rings to guide you. I got caught on the geometry. I thought I had it. I actually felt really good about that. Get moving. 
Big things popping, little things stopping. All right, here we go. That's a deep cut for you. Welcome to 2005. Okay, so I feel like I can probably just waddle this one. This platform seems big enough for the both of us. Same here. I don't think this one needs to be... Oh, nope, nope. <laughs> oh, see, this is what I said. This is the universe punishing me for my hubris before of saying that it doesn't matter. Or, sorry, not that it doesn't matter, but that, you know, people are soft nowadays with their instant gratification and, like, that doesn't apply to me as well. Like, I don't also enjoy the fact that I can get 30 moons in, you know, two episodes that doesn't feel super good. Like, Nintendo didn't just design, like, one of the best games of all time. That's just me talking out my b-hole. Alright, let's get past you. Alright. So this one, I want to position myself accordingly. And then use the rings. Oh no, no! Oh, I always undershoot that one. Ugh. At the very least, I am pretty proud of the accomplishments I've had thus far. This is probably not going to be fast enough. Nope. Hopefully you're enjoying seeing this specific area because it's a lot. One step close to the edge and I'm about to totem. All right, here we go. Not my best joke. All right, here we go. Hopefully this isn't going to be too much more of an issue. I mean, I'm getting a lot of coins in the process, so at the very least... Right. I'm just gonna overshoot it. Ugh! I think I just need to keep the glasses off a little bit longer. Man, this is... 13 kinds of stupid. If I can just get three more moons by the end of the episode... This is what you get. Oh, okay, great. Mm. All right, here's the plan. Here is the plan. One more try. If it's not happening, then I'm just going to Amscray. I feel like I've already done well enough with the other things in this area and I'm not gonna try to draw this out any longer. It's already been too much of one specific area. I feel like I'd be fine if I would just use my, my memory, which is fleeting. Ooh, I don't like that. Scoot all the way to the other side. Alright, one more time. Run all the way. There we go. And all the way. Okay, just gotta trust myself. Trust yourself before you wreck yourself. Not how the phrase goes, but I'll take it. Ooh. I'm gonna say, does that not keep going? Ooh. Even though I knew where the platform was, that still made me really nervous for some reason. I don't like that feeling at all. I didn't see what that, uh... I didn't see what that moon was called at all. Cannot say that I was aware of that. There's that bird. Heckin' bird. You're not real and I know it. Ooh, there's a pipe here. What does this do? Have I taken this before? Have I hit this pipe? Uh, I don't know. Sounds like a game. Okay. This is a rumble. HD rumble. Here? No. Here? Okay, great. <laughs> All I need to do is find one more moon. Actually, I found 15 moons in this area in 19 minutes. And that was with me just absolutely botching the last one, which is not unexpected, but you know, it is what it is. Did I try to do something up here? I feel like I did. Is this just coins? Yeah, there's a bonus over there that I did. Um, 
go ahead and check. Oh, wait. I see stuff. This is basically Mario Odyssey, if I could boil it down. This is essentially like HD, H ADHD simulator for me. Do, do you have the moon? I don't know if any of these rabbits do. So I got distracted while I was getting distracted. There's just so much to do. Same thing with like the open world Zelda games. Those are notorious. If I could do like my cap throws like the right way. Don't tell me I have to catch all three of you. I would hate that. Come here, you jerk. Okay, you're just coins. Ugh. Well, one of you has to have the moon, right? I don't like catching one of these rabbits, let alone having to do three of them in a row. I hate this a lot. Ooh, wait. Felt that. Felt a rumbling right here in this hill. Nothing? I felt it. I feel it in my bones. I don't know what the right way is to do this. Yeah, I hit you. Come back here. You scrub. Okay, so that's two. If this isn't a moon, I'm sorry, viewers, for wasting your time. They might not be, honestly. For some reason, like, there's no music here, which is a little alarming. It's just kind of like the howling of the desert. It almost kind of feels like, um... There we go. That's a good 30th moon. Um... It almost kind of sounds like the... The Tetra Talkie Stone sound it's like the whoa, that's not what it sounds like it sound like at all it's like whoa, like that but not like that so just pretend what it actually sounds like and then ignore what i just did all right i don't know if this is the best way to do this oh boy i've goofed nope i'm gonna do a hard reset i think that i'm honestly on track for above average amount of moon collectage How on earth? What? Is there a speed flower around here? How do they expect you to get all those? There's no way. What? Game. Let's be real here. Like... I'm, I'm like long jumping and everything and I'm... Huh? I mean, even the roll, unless I need to do like the, uh, like a roll shake kind of a thing. Oh, I guess if you don't. <laughs> All right, okay, okay, okay. I guess it kind of works if you don't, um, you know, screw it up entirely. This would be a nice one to have a Jaxi for. I don't think you can do that though. They're probably trying to encourage you to roll out. Here we go. Try it again. One more time. Oh, it's really hard to stay on target. Nope, not today. Oh wait, this bird though. Is it bird time? Oh no, I missed it. <laughs> Come back to me! Oh, I almost had it. I'm just gonna be like, awkwardly... No, stop. That was not meant to be a backflip. I can feel something under my buns. Where is it? Probably nothing. Viewers, I'm so sorry. This has just been a... Circus of errors. Okay, I already had it. I don't know if that bird comes back anytime soon. Would love it to. To try to go above and beyond my... Typical 15... That I do for y'all. All y'all. All you all. Oops. Yeah, I'm getting very dangerously close to the end of this video, though, so I might just call it and save face. I want that bird, though. Tired of them spying on me. I got nothing. I don't know. But I feel like I did get a really awesome amount of moons. Like, 15 moons in this amount of time is pretty heckin' impressive. No matter how you slice and dice. Oh, wait, can I do this? Who are you? I'm wearing the garb of your people. This is something I was actually mentioning in the last episode that I didn't get to say.
is that there were people that when this area came out were like, oh man, this is so offensive to like Mexican and Latin culture and blah, 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 blah. And then, you know, they actually asked legitimate, you know, Hispanic people and were like, hey, were you offended by that? And basically unanimously they were like, no. So I guess this is a good place to say it as I wind down this episode is that don't be offended on other people's behalves. Don't do that. That's actually like the worst thing that you can do. If you're concerned about whether or not it's going to bother people, you can just ask and then just don't do it. You know, pretty simple, I would say. But I think that's that's pretty much it for today. Like I said, the previous moons are going to just be lost to time, unfortunately, but you did get to see that many and one more. So I did that for you. And, uh, yeah, next time I'll, uh, be doing my best to collect some more. We're going to spend probably one more episode here because there's, there's just so much to do. And, uh, yeah, I will, uh, see you all next time. So thanks for watching, everybody. I've been D-Mike. This has been Super Mario Odyssey, and I'll catch you next time for more. Bye.